Positively Fort Wayne, brought to you by Adventure Homes. Luxury and comfort for less. I have borderline personality disorder. I have major depression recurring, and I have PTSD. 55-year-old Deb Florian is one of many Fort Wayne residents who finds comfort at the carriage house. I come here and I get welcomed and we're a big family. I have not cut myself or tried to kill myself or been in the hospital in 10 years. I'm very proud of that and grateful. This upstairs group. Andy Wilson is the executive director. We do non-traditional psychosocial rehab for adults with serious mental illnesses. So that's a mouthful for helping people with bipolar disorder, major depression, schizophrenia, uh, recover and reintegrate into the community. We are now entering the snack bar area. Operated by Carriage House members, this snack bar is one of many areas where members work side by side with staff. They work in the kitchen. They work at the front desk. They work anywhere in the house and on the property to maintain their clubhouse. The basis of the Carriage House is shared, meaningful work. That's how we get to know each other. That's how we build confidence and help people with self-esteem. So we'll help move people and we'll help people with employment and people with education and people with community support. We see what our needs are. Someone might be kicked out of their house and we help each other in any aspect it need, whether it be getting Medicaid billing or housing. Local grants and individuals fund programs at the Carriage House, along with some Medicaid funding. Its biggest private fundraiser is an event that's become the largest of its kind in the Summit City. Oh, it's wonderful. It's called Dancing with the Fort Wayne Stars. We always have 10 uh, celebrity dancers mm -hmm. paired with 10 professional dancers from the community. And this year, one of those celebrity dancers is Wayne TV account executive Tracy Martin. This is 25% of the carriage house uh, budget. Martin and the other dancers hope their moves persuade people to buy votes. Vote for us, vote for anybody. Just, just vote, please. The celebrity who raises the most money wins a trophy and bragging rights, but the carriage house is the biggest winner. How much money has this event raised for the carriage Holy house? Holy cow, it's crowding $2 million oh now over, over 12 years, I think. And it's money that goes a long way. We're trying to build a, a community, a community full of hope and full of opportunity and full of laughter. And what we find is uh, if we can make that community well enough, mm -hmm. people get better in it. I wouldn't be alive if it wasn't for the clubhouse. I really wouldn't be. I'm very grateful.